Good afternoon, everyone. It's Widowed Mom Raising Two Sons back with a Dollar Tree video. I wanted to get on and do this real quick before the boys and I, my hair's a mess. It was windy outside. Before the boys and I head out for a um, graduation party that we have this afternoon. So, and Coco's here, of course. He saw me getting all the things on the counter. So he was like, I've got to go over there and see what mom's doing. So, I will get started. There's Trent. He's going to make an appearance, everybody. He had a rough day yesterday, but we're going to have a better day today, aren't we? Rough day? Yeah, yesterday. What? Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, we we got through that okay. It was rough saying our goodbyes. Um, but we're going to go today. We're going to have a graduate attend a graduation party. For a young man that um, used to live by us, a, a dear, dear family. Um, they knew my husband very well. We were we were just dear, dear friends. And so this is this is a big celebration we're going to go to and see them. And it's just going to be it's going to be fun, like old times. So I did go into the Dollar Tree. Um, I found. You know, a lot, I've got a lot of snack items because my kids are on summer break. So, um, that's what I got. And then I did get Trenton some of these Star Wars things. He, he already opened them, but that's, that's Darth Vader's and That's Darth Vader. Pie in the shop. This is, and these are heavy, heavy. They're not little. You know, they're not rinky dink, but that's Darth Vader. Oh, yeah. yeah. And this that, that is cool. Darth that Maul. And this is Darth Maul. And then who's this? That's Bubba Fett. And this is Bubba Fett. So I did find these at the local Dollar Tree. They had them on a display up by the register. They must have had, excuse me, tons more because, but these are what I picked up for him. So. He wanted to show those so I got him those three so if you're a Star Wars fan be looking out for these these were up by my checkout on an end cap so and then I got him some bugles he's already gotten into the bugles nacho flavor he loves those loves 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 two packages oh, my hair is a hot mess from being out in the wind um, Two packages of AA batteries. Trent uses these in his Xbox. Um, uses these in his Xbox controller. Okay, hey, please don't do that. That's noisy on the counter. And we drink a lot of water in this house and my kids flavor it with the Weiler's Pink Lemonade. It has 10 calories and zero sugars. So my oldest absolutely loves this. So I picked up four containers of that, four packages of that. I also picked up some dry scalp shampoo, the VO5. We really like this. We have dry hair. And then I picked up some of this new passion fruit smoothie with soy milk protein moisturizing shampoo. I really like this shampoo. I really like how my hair feels after um, washing my hair with this. So that is a good shampoo. I picked up some of the Sure Sense Angel Blossom Air Freshener. My son, Tyler, he, he has allergies, allergies, allergy, allergies. And the pollen is so bad here in Northern Indiana right now. I mean, it looks like snow on the ground and his father suffered from allergies very very bad and so Tyler has inherited that and he was out mowing in the yard all day yesterday working for his uncle and so now he is just uh, his eyes everything so I got him some of these eye drops to try to see if maybe that will help until we can get him into the doctor on Monday um, to get the shot um, to make him feel better. That's the only way to get him to feel better is to um, get the shot and take some Benadryl. So yeah, so 
So he's kind of all, and I hate it, but my husband was the same way, same way. And I found this Sassy and Chick Moisturizing Foundation in Medium One. I thought I'm gonna try that. It was the only one they had. All the rest were dark, but I thought I'm gonna try this. And then if I can, and if I like it and it matches, then gosh, for a dollar to get foundation, that would be, that would be awesome. Cause I'm wearing Mary Kay foundation right now. I like it, but I feel like the, um, the color I'm using, I have to use a lot of it. So I'm, I don't know. I don't know if I need to be color matched again or what, but I just feel like I'm putting a lot on. It doesn't feel like a lot on, but when I have it in my hand, it does. So let me know what your foundations you use, what what colors and what brand, because um, I'm I, I'm willing to try, you know, try anything. So, because I really enjoy wearing makeup again. My kids hate it because I'm in the bathroom longer in the morning, but you know, I get up way before them and it's summer break now, so they're sleeping when I'm up getting around for work picked up some mayonnaise. I really like their mayonnaise. I can't taste a difference in it. Then I picked up some more disinfectant wipes. I really, really like the disinfective wipes. I wipe everything down. I want it fresh, clean. I don't want any germs. No germs. I picked up two of the cotton rounds to remove my makeup, my eye makeup. And then I bought four boxes of the Puffs Kleenex because poor Tyler is going through a lot of Kleenex. Poor kid. So, yes, I picked up four boxes. I picked them up while I saw them because they were pretty low on Kleenex. And probably because of allergy season, everybody's in there picking up Kleenex. So, I picked up four boxes while they had them. And then, oh, Trenton left his open bag of bugles here. I did buy more bugles because I knew he liked them. And then I picked up a retractable um, card holder. Let me see if this is got, oh yes, good. This is why I bought them because I have to wear a name badge and the name, I'm used to wearing my name badge at school. It's thin, it doesn't bother my neck, but my one I have now, um, the band is thick and I don't like it. It goes on my neck. So I bought I bought one of these. I'm gonna try to put my badge on there, clip it on my shirt, you know, and see if I'm more comfortable like that. So yeah, I picked those up for a dollar. I picked black, they had blue, pink, and I think green, but I thought black would just match with everything. So I'm, I was happy they had those. I picked up some sharpeners. They look like a fish. So I won a giveaway a while back ago um, from Kathy Donovan. I won an adult coloring book and she set colored pencils with it. So I need something to sharpen my colored pencils with because I've been setting and coloring. It's really, I enjoy to set and color. You come home from work or, you know, all the stress we've had over the last couple weeks. I just, I'll make time like, okay, I've got a set and I color and it relaxes me. And I wish my Dollar Tree would get the big, thick coloring books. That's another thing, friends. If you get, if your store gets the big, thick coloring book, adult coloring books, I would gladly pay you for them and even pay for shipping. I would love that because I love to set and color. So keep that in mind. I picked up some of the neon colored pencils. I thought, um, I thought I'd try those out and see if they work pretty good. There's only eight colors, but I thought, I'll try it out. Then I picked up 48, there's 48 in here of the plastic forks. We use a lot of the plastic silverware during the summer, because that's another thing that seems to walk away is silverware. I think my youngest takes it to his room and then he forgets to bring it out and then we find it when he cleans his room and then we just throw it away because it's gross. Nasty. I picked up the mega size paper towel. Some more cheese balls. 
two things of the toilet paper. I absolutely love this Dollar Tree toilet paper. I always pick it up when I'm in there. Even if I don't need it, I pick it up because you never know. You're gonna forget it sometime and then wowzer. I picked up some animal crackers. I love to take these for a snack at work. Two more packages of the Bugles. And I am so sad. I, I absolutely love the Dollar Tree alphabet cookies. Emily's ideas introduced me to those cookies and oh, they are so delicious. But my Dollar Tree has not had them for over a month. And I go every time thinking, oh, I'm gonna score my alphabet cookies. And I don't. So I hope Dollar Tree gets those back because they haven't had them for like a month. And I'm like, I love those cookies. And then I got Tyler some of the pretzel rods. He loves pretzels. And that's a good healthy snack. You know, good healthy snack. And I better stand back up because I'm reaching. And then I picked up my kids like these, the Buddy Bars, they're good. So I got one, two, three, four, five. Five boxes of the Buddy Bars. And I wanna try these out, the Ginger Snaps. So I thought, well, I'll try these out. Give those, we'll give those a try. And then these were up by the cash register. And I think, I think somebody's told these, but I'm not exactly sure. They're Italian cookies, and there's eight packages on the inside, and I picked up the chocolate flavor, so I got that, and then I got two bags, so I thought we could definitely try those out and see, you know, see how they are, and then I picked up some tortilla chips, I'm reaching guys, I'm sorry, and you all know that I absolutely love the app, Ellie's Bagels. I absolutely love these bagels. I buy them whenever they have them. I put them in my freezer. They are so delicious. Trenton even likes these. I get that hazelnut spread at the Dollar Tree and he'll make himself a bagel and put the hazelnut spread on it and he loves it. So I always pick these up when I see them at the DT. So, and then I bought these last week, the cheddar. I think it was the cheddar. They were really, really good. So hopefully it was the cheddar that I bought last week. So I got two of those. These, whenever I see them at the Dollar Tree and I've went through a pack, I pick them up. These work fabulous. If you're, if you have a dishwasher, buy a pack at your DT and try them out. You won't be disappointed definitely will not be disappointed at all. Then I picked up two packages of the large trash bags. This is something they don't always have in stock either. So when I saw them today, I picked up two packages because they didn't have them last week. And then we've never tried these. I won't try them. The kids will. Um, they're honey glazed honey buns. You get six in a package. So I picked up two. Okay, and I have to walk over here. Sorry. And I picked up two packages of the napkins. Two packages of the napkins. And I've got things all over. Sorry. And two graduation cards. The other graduation card I've already got sealed up and everything. So. We have graduation parties coming, so I grabbed um, two cards. I'll get more next week when I go in for the others we have coming up. So that was my Dollar Tree haul. As you can tell, I didn't have any stationary items except, you know, like the colored pencils and the um, pencil sharpeners. They have not gotten anything new in. The stickers are, are pretty much wiped clean. No new stationery. I have been on the lookout for the stationery that comes with the stickers so you can decorate the front cover. No, my DT has not gotten that. I am on the lookout for that. That is on the top of my wish list. 
but I did not find anything in the stationary aisle in the new of stickers or novelty pins or novelty notebooks. So kind of sad. And I'm seeing everybody haul all these beautiful, um, oh, what do I want? What do you want? What do I want? Oh, okay, talk. The beautiful um, planner items. My DT never gets the beautiful planner items. How I wish my DTs in my area would get those, but they don't. I would love to have a whole thing of the DT planner items that I just think they're beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So with that being said, that was my Dollar Tree haul. And yesterday in my Walmart grocery haul, I had mentioned that I reached 600 subscribers this week. Thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. I greatly appreciate everyone being a part of my YouTube family. It means a lot to me and my boys. When I started this journey back in December, December, it was a way for me to just kind of come out, share my story, and just share share our, a little bit of our lives with you. So, yes. So, thank you. I greatly appreciate it. I'm working on gathering items for um, a 600 subscriber giveaway. So, I'm hoping I'm going to go through things I have and I didn't find anything new to add to my giveaway today, but that doesn't mean anything. I have a lot of goodies here at home. So yes, so I appreciate it. I will probably do the 600 subscriber giveaway maybe on Monday because I do not work Monday this week. So I will, that is my plan. So thank you for tuning in. Have a great weekend. I'm gonna get myself put together and uh, the boys are already put together and we are gonna head out and celebrate a fine young man today on his high school graduation and wish him well as he goes off to the Marines in September. This is a dear sweet family to us and so we look forward to celebrating. So if you are out celebrating your loved ones today, be safe, be safe. And always hug your loved ones and tell them what they mean to you. So thank you for all of your support. I greatly appreciate it. I couldn't do, I can't imagine my life without YouTube and reaching out to all of you. So thank you very much. Have a great weekend. And I will be back on Monday with a video for my 600 subscriber giveaway. So stay tuned. If you're new, please tap the subscribe button and then tap the bell so you get notifications when I post a new video. So whatever you're doing this weekend, enjoy and be safe. And I will see you on Monday with another video. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye. And thank you all for your kind words and prayers. They mean a lot to us. Thank you. Bye-bye.